Hi, my name is Shannon McDermott, and I am your research attorney here at Chicago Kent Law School. Now, what I want to talk to you today is about when you're interviewing during OCI, how to look up attorneys and figure out their practice area and some in the know about what it is that they're doing. Lexis has a tool called Litigation Profile Suite that, are we, that we are going to walk through today in about five minutes to show you how you can prepare yourself best for your oncoming campus interview. First, I'm going to talk about how to get there. So first you're gonna type in www.lexisnexus.com slash law school. And that's gonna pull you into your research screen. Really quick, just to pull out some things on the law school homepage, is first you're going to see my picture with my contact information. So if you need anything whatsoever, don't hesitate to reach out. And then you're gonna see your student representatives. These were your student reps for this past spring semester. Alex, Dina, and Colin have all graduated, and we will be welcoming Elizabeth Grand, Arthur Surratt, as well as Jamie Noonan, starting in the fall. One other thing I just want to point out is Lexis is also allowing you to use your school ID in any type of situation, whether it's for a personal, classroom, or even work this summer. And any time that you log into Lexis seven days a week and you pull up a case, a statute, or even a secondary material, you will automatically get 10 daily research points. Usually research points are turned off for the summer, but this summer we are actually turning them on. So make sure that you continue to do um, your research on Lexis. Now, how do we access litigation profile suite? We're gonna go to the black button that says go to Lexis Advance, and that's going to pull us into the Lexis Advanced Research homepage. From there, we're just gonna to go to the little toggle up at the top, the grid, kind of looks like a Gmail grid, and then from there, we're going to go ahead and click on Litigation Profile Suite. Now, Litigation Profile Suite is like LinkedIn, but on steroids. So this is going to any kind of information that an attorney, a judge, or an expert witness has given to a court, and that court has published that document, we have all of that information. So you can go ahead and select any of these three. So if you'd like to talk about an expert witness, a judge, or an attorney. For today, because we're going through OCI and you're gonna be interviewing with attorneys, we're only gonna look at attorneys. So the first thing that you're gonna to wanna to do is I've actually searched Brian Lohan in the past, but I'm gonna go ahead, click attorney, and then I'm gonna go ahead and type in Brian Lohan. And as I'm typing his name, um, Lexis is learning who I'm actually looking for. And you can see that he's an uh, attorney in New York and Chicago. Once I click on his name, it's going to pull me into his profile. Now the first thing I want to show you is to look at the snapshot. So the snapshot's going to tell you all the dockets he's been a part of, the cases in particular on those dockets, and then also the briefs, pleadings, and motions. Once you actually get a job at a firm, this is really beneficial because you can actually go into the briefs, pleadings, and motions and figure out exactly how an attorney likes their briefs and pleadings and motions written, and you can follow that format. So this kind of just takes the guesswork out of what it is that the attorney is expecting from you. You can also see if he's a part of any directories and then if he's in any of the legal news. These are hot topics to talk about during interviews because this just shows that you've done your research and that you're in the know and you know exactly what it is that those attorneys are working on. So let's go ahead and walk through his profile. You're going to see his specialty that he's a part of, the law firm, his education, as well as his admissions. And then you're going to see the address where he's practicing, his telephone number, and even his email. When I would go to networking events when I was an, a law student, a lot of times I would forget to ask for the business card, um, whether I was too nervous or I just forgot because I was talking to so many different attorneys. I would use Litigation Profile Suite to find out the email of that attorney, and I would actually email them, the ones that I met, and I would say, thank you so much for your time, because we all know that the legal community is very small. Even if it wasn't an area of law that I was particularly interest, interested in, it's still good to have those contacts. And all of the jobs that I have gotten have been through networking events. So I highly recommend use it, utilizing this source. Once I scroll down, I can see his practice history by docket. So these are all of his cases by jurisdiction. I know he predominantly is, um, practices in the New York Southern District. I can also see number of cases by duration. So he has a lot of cases that are long. You can see his practice history and then dockets and so forth. So this is going to be the full list of everything that Brian Lohan has to offer that you can search on him. Make sure that you do do a LinkedIn search and you look at um, the company's website or the law firm's website because you want to make sure that you're covering all of your bases. 
But Litigation Profile Suite is going to give you a much more detailed report than anything you're going to find on LinkedIn or on their website. So that is Litigation Profile Suite. If you ever have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. Once again, my information is located right here on the homepage. And then I always highly encourage you all to meet with your guidance counselors. They will help you out in the Career Services Office. They will all help you with preparing for interviews. I know all of my LAs, my Lexus Associates, have gone to um, the Career Services Office for interview prep, and all of them have landed jobs because of what these women have to offer. So thank you so much for your time today. I really appreciate it. Good luck this summer, and I look forward to seeing you all in the fall.